Did you know that prolactin affects your health and your hormones? Let's talk about it. Prolactin is one of the most underappreciated hormones. I rarely see clinicians checking prolactin levels unless they suspect their patient has a pituitary tumor. And that's a shame because high daytime prolactin can be at the root of so many issues. Prolactin is produced by your hypothalamus and it's stored in your pituitary gland. Prolactin is a nocturnal hormone, meaning that it's produced at highest levels at night and lowest during the day. To determine proper circadian rhythm, I check prolactin around 9 a.m. in the morning. Elevated morning prolactin indicates poor sleep, not getting up with the sun, nipple stimulation within 24 hours of drawing prolactin, autoimmunity, obesity, hypothalamic dopamine deficiency, and sometimes a prolactin secreting tumor. At night, prolactin is released to help your immune system do its job better. It tells your thymus to program white blood cells properly and then release them as T cells. T cells attack invading microbes and cancer cells. If prolactin is high during the day, your immune system does not function properly. T cells attack normal tissue, which is known as autoimmunity. You may not have classic autoimmunity like rheumatoid arthritis, lupus, or thyroiditis, but you may have autoimmune tendencies. You get rashes easily, you have leaky gut syndrome, you'll get, have trouble losing weight. The majority of my morbidly obese patients have dyscircadian prolactin levels. Women with serum prolactin greater than 100 nanograms per deciliter will have overt hypogonadism, which looks like menopause, amenorrhea, hot flashes, and vaginal dryness. Serum prolactin between 20 and 100 may cause infrequent periods, and serum prolactin between 20 and 50 shorten the luteal phase, contributing to infertility and early miscarriage. And in men, if serum prolactin is greater than 50 nanograms per deciliter, it causes low testosterone production, low libido, impotency, infertility, gynecomastia, erectile dysfunction, loss of muscle mass, increased body fat, and low bone mass. Optimizing your hypothalamus with Genesis Gold helps to return prolactin to healthy circadian levels. If you have any more questions, please join me in our hormone reboot training. I'll see you in the next video.